Elon Musk just sent shockwaves throughout the industry by investing $1 billion into his brand new supercomputer. He's brought Tesla that much closer to achieving his dreams of driverless cars. But is it the investment worth it? And is the Dojo supercomputer really a game changer AI powerhouse? Let's find out. Dojo enters production. Tesla dropped a bomb during its second quarter earnings report for 2023. According to the latest reports, Tesla believes that the solution for vehicle autonomy lies in four main technology pillars, neutral net training, vehicle hardware, large real-world data set, and vehicle software. Tesla is working on developing each of these pillars in-house in its pursuit of driverless cars, and as the first step, the company is going to kick off the production of its one-of-a-kind dojo training computer, which will bring Tesla that much closer to achieving its goal of faster and cheaper neutral net training. A Closer Look at the Dojo The supercomputer was first introduced in 2019 for training AI in video processing and recognition, making vehicles capable of autonomous driving in the process. Dojo made a second appearance during Tesla's AI Day in 2021. However, it was a work in progress at the time, with only its first chip and training tiles on display. The supercomputer made another appearance during the 2022 AI Day and looked more promising than before with its full system tray. Tesla is already in possession of another outstanding Nevada GPU-based supercomputer that is one of the most powerful computers in the world. However, according to Elon, the Nevada supercomputer is simply not capable of what the company wants to achieve with the Dojo supercomputer. However, the new supercomputer is custom built and will feature chips designed by Tesla itself. The D1 chip consists of 354 custom CPU cores, 25 of these chips are interlinked into 5x5 array inside a training tile module. According to Elon, Dojo will be capable of 1 quintillion floating point operations per second. To put in perspective, you have to perform one calculation every second for the next 31,688,765,000 years to match what one supercomputer like Dojo can do in one second. With this supercomputer, Tesla is hoping to develop the software for its self-driving cars, thanks to its driver assistance software Autopilot and the full self-driving beta. Tesla has access to 300 miles of vehicle data. Dojo will have unrestricted access to these videos and will be using them to learn and essentially be a better driver. This gives Tesla a clear advantage in the race to develop autonomous vehicles, to make the AI fully functional, and the company would just need to access to large volumes of data, and thankfully Tesla has access to data from millions of vehicles. According to Musk, the Dojo barely works at 2 million training examples, but at 3 million, the engineers see something, and then at 10 million training examples, the software performs incredibly. There are no alternative for massive amounts of data, and there's no other company that can beat Tesla's collection of vehicle data. What's more, Musk is willing to put his money where his mouth is. He'll be investing $1 billion in his latest project, while the announcement has turned a lot of heads in the industry, not everyone is excited. Investors are concerned. A lot of investors were put off by Musk's decision to invest a huge amount of money in Project Dojo. Naturally, it led to a 4% postmark slide in Tesla shares. However, the company's chief financial officer, Zachary Kirkhorn, offered comfort by explaining how Tesla plans to use the $1 billion. The money will go towards two separate divisions, capital expenditures and R&D. More importantly, the decision to invest $1 billion in Project Dojo is not new. Tesla has always been building up to this moment as part of its previous three-year expense outlook. If it all goes well, Musk is hoping that Tesla's autonomous driving system will soon make its cars perform even better than a human driver. Unfortunately, Musk has provided customers with a timeline as to when the Dojo supercomputer will be fully functional. However, the tech icon did say that the company might reach an in-house neutral net training capability of 100 exa flops by the end of the next year. The Face of the Future Musk is hoping to revolutionize the automobile industry with the Dojo supercomputer. Right now, there are around a million automotive deaths each year, with an AI model that drives 10 times better than a human. The number of deaths could essentially be reduced to 100,000 each year. However, that's all possible if the supercomputer is perfect to be worked with absolute precision. So far, Tesla seems on track with the development of the Dojo supercomputer. The EV manufacturer will keep adding trays and cabinets to the cluster until it becomes the most powerful by 2024. And that's all for today. What do you guys think of Tesla's newest supercomputer? Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more updates about Tesla. Until next time, goodbye.